Yo, yo, man, it's your boy Lakitu back at it with another fucking bang. You know how the fuck I'm coming, man. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and this shit's about to be a short-ass video. I'm not gonna make this shit too long, you hear me? So you can see, man, cast them every time. Post up at the... I'm gonna open that big post up at the... At the one six mark, you hear me? That nigga was thugging right there, man. By the way, I'm gonna edit... I'm not even gonna edit this video. No thumbnail, I'm just gonna straight upload this shit because I'm tired as hell. Nigga just got home from work, but look. Shit was on the top of 106 when the market opened, you hear me? And it was kind of struggling. Man, that shit dropped back down, man. And the crazy shit is, they had some good news too. But the volume was low. You get me? And by the way, the reason my share is the lowest because I try to do a, a BA put, you know what I'm saying? As you can see a Boeing. I see boring is way too high, so I was like, hell nah. Look, for the one week, it was up 5%, one month, 15%, three month, five, yo. It's time for a put. This shit needs to cool down real quick, you heard me? So I bought a put, I sold some shares to make more money. Our CTM is going down right now. And, and look, man, I'm in this Wall Street bets guy real quick, you heard me? Let's look at his video, his CTM video. There you go, he uploaded. What's going on? So look, he was basically saying that this shit is buy. Um, for show. This is the real the real Wall Street nigga, you know what I'm saying? From right. <clears throat> he makes a YouTube now. But look, I told that nigga, bro, please, I wanna squeeze this bitch. Been waiting for three months. You know, shorts killing the fuck out of this help us push it to five dollars. Basically told the nigga what's pop. You heard me? And then he goes, I got you. Just use my video to cost a frenzy share. And share this shit on stock twists and social media. So this nigga right here, Wall Street Bets. That nigga said, I bet, cuz. I'm about to lower the pipe, you hear me? About to lower the pipe, nigga. We're going to get the word out. And we're going to squeeze the fuck out of this shit, you hear me? And I was like, hurry, bro. I soon make a video. We both be famous YouTubers and let this shit pop, you hear me? And we're still going to be big thugging. That's what I said to that nigga. That nigga said, you trying to work together? I said, yes, sir. That nigga took my Instagram and chatted him up. I can't even let y'all know what we chatted up about. I'm not a snitch. You heard me? It's all about fitness. So, yeah. As you can see, man, we on right here. Weeble. And yeah, man, as you can see, we probably got compliance because we never had these market orders on CTRM, so I don't know what the fuck is happening. And the news still hasn't come out. But yeah, man, as you can see, let me see. I don't know why it went so down today. The news is good. It makes no sense, man. I'm telling you, no sense. But look, man, 23.74 million people is buying it, 25.56. We're selling it. Probably the shorts. Like some niggas that want to make money. And some news came out too. You heard me? Says for your customary time reports a vessel acquisition. You know, they announced a new boat basically that it has an, uh, an agreement to purchase a two, 2010 Korean built. Yo, this nigga purchased a 2010, bro. You can't pay something new, bro. Fuck it though, man. 15.45 million. It's not bad though. It's not bad, man. But look, let's look at the comments. Basically, I'm the reason I'm not hype about the news is because when they, some news comes out, the stock barely moves. To be honest, it goes up and it comes down around 10 o'clock in the morning. But look, let's read some comments. I can't wait for what tomorrow. It's not interesting, basically. I will hold. It's okay. Yeah, man. Said this was going to be a short video, so it's your boy Lakeith and I'm off this.